A group of Delta workers claims the Atlanta-based airline is trying to bust up their efforts to unionize. They rallied in downtown earlier tonight, also raising complaints of racial discrimination and unfair treatment on the job. Well, Fox News' Rob DiRienzo was at that rally and went to the airline for its response. One of these Delta workers wrote a letter to her bosses after she took a flight as a paying customer. She says at the beginning of the flight, the crew put on a video about the company's efforts and accomplishments on promoting social justice. But she claims behind the scenes, it's a much different story. I want to see Delta do the right thing. And doing the right thing is living by what they preach. Amanda goodman Barry is a ramp employee for Delta. She says that video about Delta's Equal Justice Initiative contradicts her experience there. It comes with a lot of humiliation, retaliation. Uh, it comes with a lot of discrimination. It comes with being singled out. It comes with the world them making you feel like you don't belong. She rallied with Delta co-workers and pro-union activists outside the offices for IBEW local 613. Delta wants to fancy itself as a socially progressive company, but they need to put actions behind their words. Amen, bro. It can't just be a sign on the side of the plane. In a statement, a spokesperson for the airline pushed back, writing, quote, claims that Delta interferes with employees' right to choose union representation are false. The spokesperson went on to say that they believe not having to deal with a union is, quote, a stronger, faster, more effective way to drive improvements. There are over 50,000 workers who are organizing across the country, uh, and that includes flight attendants, ramp workers, uh, baggage handlers, and also mechanics. Pilots, meanwhile, are covered under another union. The group plans to travel to Memphis to the National Civil Rights Museum to honor Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s contributions to equality, justice, and labor organizing. We can appreciate Delta and the, the work that they've done uh, to create a hub for travel here in the South, but we don't have to allow that appreciation to make us forget their responsibility to their workers. And this all comes as the Atlanta-based airline has been trying to cut labor costs. Earlier this month, it announced it would lay off some office workers. Meanwhile, Delta posted a third quarter profit of $1.1 billion, up nearly 60% from last year. In Atlanta, Rob DiRienzo, Fox 5 News.